Hi everyone, this is Deb. This is my final uh, earrings every day challenge and hashtag 100 things challenge number 23. Final earrings every day challenge, not the final hashtag 100 things. Anyway, this is day 28's inspiration. You can see, maybe you can see, it's a, a wire hoop with beads on the wire wrapped at the top. The handmade ear wire has a bead on it. And then there is a dangle. The funny thing is this one looks like it has like three wraps around and this one only looks like one. I don't know. The picture may, may just not be clear. So that's the day 28. I went pretty true to it. Just a little different. Um, this is what I made. It's teal color hoops. I'm going to take one off because they slide. I don't have them through the holes on there and they slide. So this is what I made. Um, these were from Bargain Bead Box from a few months back. Maybe even last year, I don't know. So were the silver beads from one of the bead box, Bargain Bead Box uh, deliveries. This I've had in my stash from a store that was sold a few years back, uh, EE Beads. It was a local Pennsylvania store, but they only did online and they sold to I don't know, it's changed hands a couple times. I don't even know if it's in business anymore as what it was sold as. So uh, I kind of lost track. I think it was Wild Beads and then something else. And anyway, this is what I came up with. And these beads are um, like Briole. They have the, the hole going through the top of the bead. So I wire wrapped them. Um, and I did, um, I usually do like uneven numbers but since I had this in the middle I did two on each side of it then three and then two uh, with the silver spacers in between um, and I did hand make the ear wire with the with the bead on the top so that is day 28 Let me just move them out of the way okay day 29 I didn't do like they were because I don't care for this. She used a texture, it looks like a textured wire and just did a, what they call a messy wrap, just a loop at the bottom and a lot of messy wrap wire or, you know, and I'm, I'm not into the whole intentional uh, messy wrap look. I just, I, I'm sorry. I just don't care for it. Everybody, you know, teach their own. Um, so it's probably my little business sense coming in, but I made these, um, I'm going to hang them on the paper again. And I wanted this, the metal look, but I had, I've had these ornate kind of teardrop bead dangles in my stash for a while. They're not sterling. Um, and then these are actually freshwater cultured pearls and I just wire wrapped them and put them on a pre-made silver plated ear wire. So that is those and um, they're not real heavy. I think they're dressy and nice but could be for everyday wear. And then lastly, put these back over here somewhere. <laughs> I'm not crazy about these ear things. They they have holes in them, which I could put them in, but then you see they're uneven and it makes the earring look uneven. Anyway, lastly was these, um, which I, I really like this style. She's got like a chip at the bottom, which just looks like some kind of jasper or something. Little round bead under it, handmade um, I, uh, head pin, which I did do. I'll show you in a minute. And then it looked to me like she wire wrapped these beads onto this handmade, um, like a V ear wire. And I, I really like that style. But then later, after I did that, I discovered that, no, these beads are actually on the ear wire and then just wire wrapped around it to, I don't know why, actually, maybe to hold them in place. And then there is, um, this part is dangling off the bottom. So what I did is slightly different. I used um, Argentium Sterling. It's actually Argentium Silver, which is a little better than Sterling. I used Blue Lace Agate. I wire wrapped, I don't know if you can see, I wire wrapped this little bead 
one to the front of the ear wire so it sticks out a little bit and then I have a bead dangle off of that of a six millimeter blue lace agate and then these ovals at the bottom which are on handmade um, head pins just a little notch at the bottom there um, so I used 19 gauge argentum silver for these v-shaped wires and I used 22 gauge for uh, the wrapping and the bead dangles and I love blue lace agate now the thing is I had some chips but I didn't have any that were even close to consistent in size and color variation because blue lace has a lot of you know it can be clear to brown to blue to white kind of variations and I didn't find any two that I like so I went with the ovals and they're even varied because they're natural gemstones and they do vary um, oh gosh every time every time I drop them right <laughs> anyway that is my day 30 um, blue lace agate argentum silver it has a higher percentage slightly higher percentage of silver and it has um, a, an, uh, I think it's called argentium in it as well which helps prevent it from tarnishing more so than sterling so yeah those are my little earrings which I like I think if I did them again I would not wire wrap these onto the front I would just put them on the ear wire and I may make another pair like that uh, it gives it dimension I just don't know if I'm happy with totally happy with those little four millimeter wire wraps on there so yeah um so that's it that's my days 28 29 and 30 um stacy works has uh kindly given me this project share in the back and i'll change that out the next time and i was going to do a lot more today but i just got a call from my vet and i have to take my kitty in for blood work because she's having a tooth pulled tomorrow which is broken um and it's getting more abscess so poor little kitty i have to not only try and get her in the crate tomorrow now but i have to do it again today not happy about that <laughs> um, also um, for those of you that were following my jewelry in september collab that i was doing with left-handed crafter brandy hi brandy um, i had done a poll and only about three or four people answered the poll i haven't forgotten about you guys i'm trying to figure out um, what to do for you and uh, I may just come back with a question video sometime either today or tomorrow which would be Wednesday or Thursday so stay tuned um, and bear with me okay thanks guys hugs and love